Hello, welcome class to another English class and this opportunity we are going to study the past perfect using by the time when and until. Let's read the definition. We use the past perfect to show that one event in the past took place before another past event. The past perfect signals the earlier event. The simple past signals the later event. In this class, we have to know how to build sentences in the past perfect. The past perfect, the structure is subject, the past tense of the verb have, which is had, then a past participle verb. Remember, the past participle verb has two forms of verbs, regular and regular. And after that, we use a complement. Now, we also are talking about a simple past event. The, the simple path, the structure is subject plus verb in the simple past. What happened with the simple past is that you have to remember all the verbs in the past. We have regular and irregular verbs. So probably you will see this structure a little complicated, but don't worry. We're going to explain everything, but you have to read, you have to learn by heart the verbs in the simple past and the verbs in the uh, past participle form. Okay, let's see the first example. We have this example. We underline two ideas. If you see, we have later event and we have early, earlier event. So, in the past perfect, we always have two events. One event that comes first and another second event that comes later. We call them later event, this is the second event, and the earlier event is the first event. So, in order to happen the later event, we have first and earlier event. Now, you also, I want to tell you that we can use it, uh, we can switch the two ideas, okay? Like these two examples, okay? So let's read the sentence. By the time I was 20, I had bought a car. By the time I was 20, this is the late event. What is the first event or the earlier event? You have bought a car. So before you were 20, you had bought a car, okay? So, now you can read it in, 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 in the other way. I have bought a car by the time I was 20. So what happened is that you first bought a car and then you turned 20. Okay, now let's read the two, two more examples. This is using by the time the next example is using when, and the third example is using until. Let's read it. When we arrived to the party, he had already started. What is the earlier event? The earlier event, remember, he had to be in the past perfect. So this is the earlier event. He had already started. This means that the party started when 
you are right. So this is the later event. So in these kind of sentences, it might have happened something before another event happens. Okay, you have to remember that. Okay, let's read the last one. Using until. I hadn't understood until you explain. So this one is the earlier event. This is the, the past present form. And this is the simple past. You explain. Okay? So I hadn't understood or I hadn't understood until you explained. So before you explain, you hadn't understand anything. So yes. Follow the structure, follow the way I explain these sentences, and we will see more examples in the class. This is all for now, so see you in the next class. Bye.